jumps in and for example dooms the silence or it gives Enigma a free black hole. Fights should be pretty easy for for uh, Radiant. He's chasing him, isn't he? He's going for it, and that's going to be Ursh grabbing the kill. First blood in the middle lane for the Silencer, as uh, Pikachu comes all the way under the tower, one compared to the uh, Enigmas of 24 and 9. This idol is really hard. Well, y'all just found that one out the hard way, as Big Demand just to chase it down. Yeah, they, they got a hero to play around. Oh, Happy in some trouble. Can they finish the job? Oh, nice jukes around the trees. Going to allow that to uh, come off, actually. No uh, silence for you, sir. Now Blast comes out. He's going to pop that shield, and the explosion might just finish off Happy. Yep, he's gone. Realized it. Tried to turn around for a little bit of extra damage. Plantamos trying to chase down Sadoi here. Sadoi could be in some trouble. He's got no counterplay here, it doesn't look like. Fortunately, all the Oku can really do is watch him die. As Plantamos speeds up and up and up south, being popped. But what for? Plantamos got to drop all the same, and Yoku jumps in on this, but I'm not sure what he's doing. He's just going to die as well, I think. Slowing Plantamos down a little bit. Now he's got the orb, so the pug can get away safely. Plantamos does drop a bit of HP for that one, but still an absolute win. And don't forget, you can grab yourself a risk-free bet over at omg.bet. $10 for you. The links are down in the description and periodically in the chat as well. So go and check that out. Meanwhile, down the bottom lane, Plantamos and Happy could be in some trouble, but they're trying to turn it around, but I'm not quite sure that's going to happen for them right now. As Sadoi keeps on chasing Happy, going under the towel for it, will get the kill. Meanwhile, Rupture comes out, Puck's in trouble, trying to TP away, but instead toes in. He's uh, going to use a, the... Uh, Jaunt just to try and get himself a little bit more space. Y'all still chasing on this one. Plantamos though is still very, very fast, running himself down the river. Oh, there comes a black hole. Plov in some trouble, but he has got the level 6. Global Science going to come out really, really late there, but will still allow Plov to get the escape. And doesn't have to use his ultimate, even though he's got the thirst on him. So just waiting for the uh, for the tangos to kick in, and then he can get himself out of sight. Meanwhile, Sadoi is the one being chased. He's going for this bounty rune, will be able to grab it, but having to pop the ultimate for it does cost them a little bit here, but they won't be able to finish off the kill either, so Sadoi able to secure both these runes. Meanwhile, down top lane, they're going for Yoku right now, and Bignam's leading the charge, but he's running out of HP. In fact, he's gone, but in from behind. Happy finds a kill onto Yoku. Chappy being well being targeted down, but down goes Ush! Ush just gets destroyed. I didn't even realize that was the mid laner joining that fight. Pinging on Ush right now. Ush, he's, he's got the rupture on him. Trying to just gently jog away from Palantimos. Palantimos, though, he's speeded up. He's speeded up. Chappie's coming in as well. They want to try and find these kills. Silences are out. They're both blocking each other in the tree lines. Oh, she's being brought down here. What can he do? They're even just going to throw down the ultimate to Palantimos. Make sure he can go for these kills. Yokin for Yoki. Yoki on the run. Should be able to get himself away with the orb. Meanwhile, Sadoi, he's got himself an ultimate, so should be okay. But trying to defend this one, I'm not even sure if he's going to be able to. 40 minutes in. Global Science actually popped here as Ush just trying to fight down Pikachu here. Can they grab this kill in time though? Doesn't look like they can. And now the Silencer is open to just get doomed up and pulled down by Bignum. Bignum just taking him out of the fight. Meanwhile, I oh god, Lich's ulti just bouncing around the Eidolons instead. And comes the ultimate from Pikachu trying to finish off Yoku here. We'll be able to do so. Jafush just not responding. It's looking that way. Sadoi is nearby. I don't know what he's doing. He's like... Can I, can I get the Aegis, maybe? Would, would you guys mind if I just kind of jumped in? Puck? No. No, not going for it. No storm today to steal that away from Jafush. So jump up onto the high ground. Yo, I don't know what he's doing here. I don't know what any of uh, us are doing here. They just seem to be scattered. But at the same time, you have mid laner who has zero, like, items. More or less. He so gets while the attack speed though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. you <laughs> you do. But if you look at Pikachu, he has a four staff and getting closer to X. Like when Pikachu gets his X, Silencer is gonna finish his first item. Yeah, and that's gonna be like an Atos or something, right? It's 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 not gonna be extremely impactful. Uh, yeah. First item such as uh, Sadoi turning around on the Pikachu here. They just dropped the ultimate. Ursh is in trouble. Ursh is dead. He's out of here. I mean, I did drop the Doom on that one, I think it looked like. I, I think I saw it just on the tail end there, but I mean, who cares? You get the kill. If he had a Forest Dive, he might have survived. Just saying. <laughs> Yeah, Midas, Midas, you ain't out of that one, buddy. There goes that <laughs> silencer. Chappy just happy to sit on the high ground and give the Rax a slappy.
Yeah, they're throwing spells. They're, they're, they're trying to threaten, but again, you know, the, just the black hole threat is enough to hold them back really far. It's like, oh, we have global silence at the very least, though. They're jumping onto Pikachu a little bit here. They're forcing him away, but Pikachu is easy Aegis Holder. They don't want to use it just like that. Meow and Chain Frost coming out as well. It's actually not a bad one inside with the coil as well, but Plantamos, he's absorbing most of the damage here, and he's being healed up by Happy, and they're just going to try and uh, negate the damage as best they can, but meanwhile, Big Nip's actually died on the front lines. Plantamos taking all this damage, and he's going to get finished off as well. Ursus might be making a turnaround. Pikachu's going to die once, probably dying again as there's no one here to save him. Chappie, he's thinking about trying to do something here, but what can he do? He has... Not got enough matter for Black Hole. Pops are soaring, but it's not there. He's just trying to threaten, I think, and just trying to flex them out of here. Meanwhile, Pikachu, go for the TP. Is there anything? Pounce? No, it's too late. They don't find it, so they'll just grab Chappy instead. At least the OD makes it away, but four heroes dropped on the side of 178. Be the target, Pikachu coming forwards. He's already used the four stuff, though. Bignum sees him in the trees. Y'all going for the TP out as well. They see Sadoi. In comes one stun. In comes a second. <laughs> Down goes Y'all. I'm not even sure that one was intentional. They might have just accidentally caught him in the trees with that purge. Sadoi. He's going to get slucked up again. Meanwhile, Nokachi goes down to bottom to Palantamos and Sadoi getting dropped as well. Now it is four kills across the map. Goodness gracious. Well, bottom lane might be tempting for them, but uh, with no... Oh, they're jumping in. They might have found Ush here. Palantamos coming in with the silence, trying to time it right and will be able to do so. And now comes out the Doom. Ush, I don't think he's getting out of that one. Ulti being dropped as well. Shield on Tim as well. He's trying to turn around, trying to fight this one, but he will be dropped. Trying to get the buyback, will be able to do so. Meanwhile, the Coil comes out, holding Jeffush in. In comes the Ice Blast as well. Chain Frost bouncing around, but where is it going? Is finding a target. Big number one being pulled down here. Astral going to buy him a little bit more time. Palantamos with the BKB on the front lines, trying to fight up into this one. And they will allow their Doom to get out of jail here with that blink dagger as well, comboing very nicely with the astral. Urso, they might think of coming forward for more here, but they might want to think twice about this one. They did just buy back on their silencer. Their heads at this high ground, I guess. Maybe, uh, well, Roche is up, so. Oh. Pikachu going for the TP. The pounce actually missed, but Yol will not. He comes in with the Sinister Gaze. No escape this time around. Pikachu again bought down. You get your debuffs for whatever reason, then. Yeah, they know. And they're going on to Plov right now, and they managed to get the Astral onto him. Bigdom coming in from behind as well. They've got the Black Hole should they want to use it, but Plov just is going to be able to escape with the ulti. I Meanwhile, Yoki comes in from behind. They're trying to use Pikachu here. He's coming pretty deep, and Sadoi's like, yeah, Black Hole me. I want to be Black Hole. Give it to me, Daddy. Meanwhile, in comes the Chain Frost bouncing around Chappy. He's trying so hard to get a Black Hole up here, and he's trying to force the issue way too much. Pikachu, he is going to sink here. There's too much damage being thrown out onto him. Down goes the OD. Palantimos, Big Num, they're pressing that reverse button as quickly as they can but unfortunately I don't think there's a way out of this one they're just chasing them down Palantimos is gonna drop big them on the run going north but the rest of Vera is trying to chase him down they smell blood and they smell doom and they want to get him but a nice little duke into the tree line there confusing them for a little bit longer big them on the run giving them the old one too but unfortunately I think his days might be numbered I think I mean he's fast he's fast as hell and he's got a doom now as well go on doom the puck kill puck do it do it yes. All right, this might spell the end for Bignum, the man, the myth. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> what a beast, Elder. The real experts. Urus on the hunt right now, and they might find someone. Palantimos is going to be the target. He's got that BKB. Should he want to pop it, or might just accept his death? Oh, no, he's, he's going to accept his death and pop his BKB. There we go. Yo, come sliding in and finds Happy. This might be the plus one. In fact, it's looking like it's almost definitely going to be the plus one. Trying to keep himself, make himself annoying for as long as possible, but down he shall certainly fall. And that's a quick two kills as Plov taking him down on the slark here with the rest of his team a great rotation in from urus here and a doom just built ags and built uh shadow blade it's yeah. not by detection <laughs> there just he just killed everyone every time <laughs> happy meanwhile he's he's not having a good time he's not having a good time Ooh, it's hero hero who is it it's pikachu again uh-oh he needs help and he needs it now but unfortunately i'm not sure help is anywhere near they are not even trying to make their way over they're just like pikachu you're in a stupid place and you're gonna die a stupid death for it I mean, Ursus just forced a BKB, an Oracle ulti, a death on the OD as well. What do you do now, Jafush? What do you do now? Ursus, they are pushing up on the high ground and they are looking damn good right now. I've, I'm, I'm kind of ha having a feeling that they could have fought this on Jafush. That, like, they saw the silencer, so Doom could have just jumped in, doomed him. Yeah, I'm checking it now. Abyssal. Untouched. Oh, Pikachu popping the BKB, trying to turn it around onto Plov. Plov just popping the ultimate. Global Science being used as well. They really want to bring down the OD right now, and they should be able to do so. But in comes Chappie. Get off my core. Get out of here, he says. 
popping the BKB, popping the Blink Dagger, getting himself forwards. There is no global silence for him anymore. Pikachu coming onto the front lines now. They've got the Doom onto Sedoya. As Bignum has that Ags, there's no chance of getting that ultimate off as they just turn around, deal with Yol. That's going to be a dead Lich Meme. On the back lines, they have allowed Sedoya to escape. I'm not too sure about turning around and just everybody focusing down the Lich, but... Yeah, well, it always looks questionable if you don't get the kill with it, right? Like, the idea is to try and get the kill as quickly as possible. Unfortunately, wasn't there in time, but Sadoi is now in trouble once again. Uh, this time, still doesn't have the ultimate, actually. No, he had it. He had the ultimate, Where but he it? got bursted. Flicker for what? Slark jumping in, looking for Happy. Happy's just going to get melted, but the black hole comes in. Immediate silence coming out in response. Chappie does have a refresher orb. Should he want to pop it? He certainly does. There comes the second, but a double silence. What the fuck? <laughs> there goes the second one. So Chappie on the run. Doom comes out, though, onto Plum. Slark, though, just turning around. He actually activated the, sa the Satanic before he got doomed up, so he's able to survive a little bit longer, but will still drop. Meanwhile, Ash just trying to get the damage off, but now Palantimos on top of him. He's getting taken down as well. Good night, sir. Ash gets dropped along with Plum, along with Yoko. And that is going to be a four-man team wipe near and nearly as... Uh, oh, I uh, did, did drop low there, but managed to get himself back. Uh, Pikachu and Plantamos went completely atop, but in comes Yol going in with the two-man silence. But they just immediately turn around. They'll be able to block the Slark, maybe. But no, no, never mind. Sorry. The Lich nearly got taken down there, but they're on top of Plantamos. Plantamos got to lose his life once. The rest of the team, there's two heroes nearby looking to make their way into this one, but Pikachu is going to have to get ulted up. Meanwhile, the coil comes out onto Plantamos. In comes a rupture, though, onto Plov. Plov's in trouble. They need to help him out here, but he's going to be able to pop that ultimate. Turn around. Let's start bashing into Plantamos. Plantamos is dead. The Yoki helping out with the, uh, ooh, up onto the high ground. They see Pikachu, but they don't get the bash. That was fairly... Fortunate as they turn around get happy as well and the shoe is now on the other foot, but guess what the Oracle he doesn't have money for buyback I'm Not sure with this item choice though refresher on on Puck. It's good that Shows he can get out, this buyback in from Palantimos as well They are gonna repel them from the base just with these buybacks. It looks like <clears> oh <throat> myth And they go, you're getting beaten down as Pikachu just tears through him, but Sadoi and Plov just trying to get through Pikachu's defensive. In comes the black hole, immediately silenced out though, and Chappie actually refreshed before he, but no he didn't, he turns around with the refresher, jumps into the fight, two dooms out as Plov's getting beaten down, still trying to fight through this, but the pain is too much from Palantimos and Bignum. They'll bring down the Slark. Chappie, he was extremely slow with that refresher orb there. And there's your buyback coming out from the Slark as well. Doesn't want to give away Roshan as they've got the fear out onto Pikachu. Where's the follow-up? It's not there. Bignum comes in, scaring them both away. Yoku comes in deep, but he's got to be cautious. He's only a little fairy dragon. Meanwhile, Plov comes pouncing in. This guy doesn't have buyback. It seems very aggressive from him. As the door, he's sitting on the front lines and taking huge hits there. Does have to be careful about getting ulted. Too much damage might just cause his ulti to completely skip here. As in comes Bignum. They're trying to take down the Doom, but in comes the False Promise. They're looking to blast. Plantamos and said Plantamos drops. Pikachu turns around, kills off Yol. Trying to fight up into them right now. They're trying to focus him down. The BKP will end and then comes the Astral. BKP ulti from Chappie. Where's the silence? Where's the damage? Well, Ush will come in and be able to take down Chappie all the same. And Pikachu's going to get dropped as well. That's going to make it four dead. Looking for Happy as well. Boo! Dagon comes out. Brings down Happy again. As it's a triple kill from Ush. No OD. No Bloodseeker. This may well just be the final push into it incredible fight from dire this puck is doing so much so much work done by this puck he just flies around the fights at a million miles an hour impossible to lock down impossible to kill always throwing out these silences and this ridiculous aoe this is really quite something as they jump in deep once again looking for bignum bignum turns around turning into ush trying to bring him down if he can kill santa here he does not have buyback but unfortunately the heels are coming out on him they're just trying to turn around kill off the doom doom dead no buyback this might be the end urus should take the series 2-0 nothing left chappies run out of black holes and the other guy's just an oracle and he's getting beaten down inside his base anyway down he goes Enigma going the same way as well. We'll watch the door hit the tier fours. I think we're supposed to be watching a uh, replay here or something. I don't know. The game's over anyway. And it will go to Urus. The entire series, in fact, going to Urus as they'll make their way further in the upper bracket here in the Hainan Masters Invitational. Very impressive. Few luck.